Good afternoon. Our first item of business today is Time for Reflection, and our Time for Reflection leader is Medina Javid of Andalus Glasgow, a law graduate, peace activist, and campaigner for women's rights, for the women's right to perform public Quran recitations. Presiding officer, members of the Scottish Parliament, thank you for the opportunity to address you today. Two years ago, I was invited to the same cathedral where I had spent my childhood attending the Montessori nursery. My local Christian friends welcomed me back to St Mary's Cathedral in Glasgow to share a recitation of the Quran. I was touched when the congregation came up to me to thank me and express how moved they were. News of this event reached all corners of the world. There was an outcry from groups in America. As offensive and threatening messages were sent, the congregation showed me an outpouring of love, support, and kindness. The Quran says, Ya ayyuhan nasu inna khalaqnakum min dhakarin wa untha wa ja'alnakum shu'uban wa qaba'ila lita'arafu O oh, humankind, we created you from a male and female and made you into peoples and tribes so that you might come to know each other. During Eastertide, Dr. Greta Mary Hare, who I met at the cathedral, sent me a card wishing me a wonderful Ramadan with a gift of a box of ma'mul, pastries from the Middle East made with dates. She told me that the design on top of the pastries represents the crown of thorns and that the pastries are shared between Muslims and Christians. We had run out of dates to break our fast that evening, so I had one of Greta Mary's ma'mul. The reward of my fast was thus shared with her as whoever feeds a fasting person will have the reward of their fasts too. Ramadan is here once more. The purpose of fasting is to reconnect with God, to renew intentions, and to recognize the potential within oneself to be a more beautiful hearted human being. Love of God does not mean much at all if it does not mean love for our neighbors. We draw closer to God when we draw closer to one another. At St. Mary's Cathedral, we all came together to know one another. We must all come together, people of faith and people of no faith at all. The Quran says, each person faces a particular direction so race each other to do good deeds wherever you are god will bring you all together god has power over all things <laughs> 